Welcome to my presentation. In this presentation, we shall see examples on operations with limits. Let us take an example here. And in this example, we want to find the limit. And the limit is as follows. Limit of the function x to the power of 2 minus 4x plus 3 as x approaches 5 as x approaches 5. So the way we want to solve this problem is as follows. We'll write it down in these different steps. We will break down this polynomial uh, function into individual functions. So we'll write it out as limit of that first um, value, well, first function which is x to the power of 2 as x approaches 5 minus limit of the second function 4, 4x as x approaches 5 plus limit of this constant term 3 as x approaches 5. So in our second step we will substitute the values of x as equal to 5 and then we will simplify the math. So in the first one, we have limit as x to the, uh, as a limit x to the power of two as x approaches five. So we're going to substitute the value of x as equal to five raised to the power of two minus in the second one. We have a constant number multiplied to uh, multiplied to the variable x. So we're going to substitute. We're going to pull out the constant term outside and substitute the value of x as equal to five like that. Plus, the, in the third one, the constant of a limit is the constant number itself. So therefore, limit of uh, a constant number 3 as x approaches 5 is still going to be equal to 3. So therefore, we're going to simplify this math here in step number 3. We'll write this as step 3. 5 times 5 is 25. 5 to the power, five ti 5 to the power of 2 is 5 times 5, which is 25. 5 times 4 is 20 plus 3. Then 25 minus 20 is 5. 5 plus 3 is going to be equal to 8. Therefore, when we find the value of the limit uh, of this function, x to the power of 2 minus 4x plus 3, as x approaches 5, the value of that limit is going to be equal to a positive 8 like that. Let's take another example here. In this example, we want to find the limit of this particular function. Limit of 5x cubed plus 4, the whole thing divided by x minus 3, like that, as x approaches 2. In here, we will, to solve this uh, limit, we're going to break it down into these different steps. We will write down, since it belongs to that coefficient of a limit um, operation, we're going to write this one out as follows. We're going to write this as limit of the numerator part, which is 5x to the power of 3. Let me write this again. 5x to the power of 3 plus 4 as x approaches 2 divided by the limit of the denominator function x minus 3 as x approaches 2. So now we can break it down into a couple of more uh, steps and then we can we can write this one as limit of x as x approaches 2 the first uh, first part of the numerator uh, function is 5x to the power of 5x to the power of 3 like that plus the limit of the constant number 4 as x approaches 2 we broke the broke down the numerator part into individual limits like that divided by we will break down the the denominator part similarly like what we did in the numerator, the limit of the first function x, like that, as x approaches 2 minus 
the limit of the constant number 3 as x approaches 2. Now we are ready to simplify all of that. So uh, we'll call this as step 2 and we'll call this one as step 3. In step 3 we're going to simplify all of that. We're going to start to uh, substitute the values of x as x approaches 2. In the numerator we have a constant number 5 and the value we want to substitute for x is 2 so 2 to the power of 3 is what we have plus in the numerator the second part of the numerator is limit of the limit of a constant number as x approaches 2 is going to remain as a constant number 4 in the denominator we have limit of x as x approaches 2 so we can write this one as we can substitute the value of x as equal to 2 minus the limit of uh, the constant number 3 as x approaches 2 is not going to change so therefore we're going to leave it like that so therefore now we are now we, in our in our next step we can simplify the maths a, a, a bit more in here we have 5 times 2 to the power of 3 2 to the power of 3 the base number is repeated 3 times 2 times 2 times 2 which is going to be equal to 8. 2 times 2 is 4, 4 times 2 is equal to 8, so therefore instead of 2 to the power of 3 we can write as 8 plus 4 divided by 2 minus 3 is negative 1, like that. So now we can simplify this math some more. 5 times 8 is equal to 40 plus 4 divided by negative 1. 40 plus 4 is going to be equal to 44 divided by negative 1. A positive number divided by a negative number is going to give us a negative value. So 44 divided by 1 is going to be equal to 44. Negative 44 is our answer. So therefore when we when we simplified, when we wanted to find the limit of this uh, function, 5x to the power of 3 plus 4, the whole thing divided by x minus 3, as x approaches 2, the value of that limit is going to be equal to negative 44. Negative 44. In my next presentation, we shall see examples on operations with limits.